Hey, it's Danny, the intern with uh, Jeff Palmer, director of instruction here at beautiful Olympic View Golf Club. Uh, Jeff, when we first started this about, uh, what, uh, I think this is like class number five or something? I think so. Week five, yeah, that's right. So, uh, you know, at first we kind of talked a little bit about goals and, and kind of what I wanted to achieve with, uh, with this whole project DTI. Um, so one of them is, A, uh, make sure that I look like I know what I'm doing, even That's right. though I don't. Uh, how's that coming <laughs> along so far? You know what, I, Danny, I've watched you hit a few shots. You're going through the pre-shot routine properly. You're hitting uh, some shots up in the air. You're getting some distance. So it's coming along really nicely. Uh, uh, you know, everybody feels like they don't know what they're doing when they start out. Right. And uh, so, you know, sort of understanding... You know, what is a good result and what isn't is, is key. So we'll, we'll talk more about that as well. Okay, that's great. Um, and goal two is because I'm currently, and again, not like an, an avid golfer yet, but I'm currently shooting a 160. So would it be realistic to shoot for a hundred? Like would that, is that like a, is that a realistic goal? The, um, the, the very first milestone is to break a hundred. You know, that not, you know, 99 or 98, the, to, to get under a hundred is the first big, big milestone. Uh, um, for a new golfer, for you, uh, but, but, it, but also that takes time, and uh, it doesn't happen overnight. It's like there's a lot of golfers that uh, uh, don't break 100 for a, a couple of years. So I think for you, you know, it's ba you know, it's one step at a time, baby steps, so to speak. It's 160 now. In a month, it'll be 150. You know, we want to just go one step at a time. Okay. What will happen as you go through your lessons is you will start to improve more and more quickly. Goals uh, small and realistic and attainable. Okay, fair enough. Uh, and the other thing I wanted to talk to you about was you guys have a lot of programs here at Olympic View. One of them happens to be uh, the WAG program, Wine About Golf. Can you talk a little bit about that? Yeah, it's um, it's a social uh, uh, learning environment where we get um, women together. Uh, women grab their friends or their family and come out, and we do five weeks of lessons. Uh, but each after each lesson, we go in and we have a wine. We have a glass of wine. We have uh, a, a chef's special uh, dinner, and uh, so we can kind of sit down and kind of complain about the uh, hopefully not the instruction. But, uh, <laughs> But, uh, you know, sort of uh, sort of chat about the game, and, and uh, it, it creates a really social atmosphere while learning. So, uh, great deal. Uh, it's uh, $379, includes uh, five meals, five weeks of lessons, uh, golf clubs, uh, the equipment rentals is, is complimentary, as well as two rounds of sunset golf at Olympic View. So, it's a great, a great deal. Yeah, that is a great deal. Um, I got to tell you that... Uh when I got here, I was excited about, about joining the women, and that's what we're going to do today. We're going to join the women on Wine About Golf Lesson 1. Um, uh, but I kind of pictured in my mind that these women would be like 60, 70. I had no idea that we were going to get like hot, gorgeous females. Have a look at them, Kat. Because now, now I have to golf with these women. They're going to be like, hey, he's already an idiot. Now like he's so not even next to our level. So... Um, things are off to a good start. Thank you for that. Roger. That. Oh. Let's say hi to Michelle. Hi. Michelle, do you go left or right? Right. Also, I'm left-handed though. Left-handed goes right. Interesting. Good to know. Uh, also, I like your shades. Thanks. Um, okay, you're up. Let's uh, let's see what's up. <laughs> also, six shoes. Can we get a shot of the shoes? <laughs> Those are wicked. Nice. I'm so screwed. <laughs> Sweet. Ah, nice. Candace. Candace, very nice to meet you. I'm Danny, the intern. Uh, also, I noticed that you have um, the breast cancer support uh, ribbon on your yeah. clubs. That's very cool. Uh, this is actually going to help you drive that ball a lot further than mine. So, good Sounds on you. Sounds good. They're even on your clubs, too. Look yeah, at this. It's a whole breast cancer nice awareness set. How, where on earth did you get that? Look at that. Um, oh, wait. Look at this way. Yeah. That's amazing. Where, did, where on earth did you find these? Golf Town. They had like some special on last year for breast cancer awareness. So. That's awesome. So doing your part and enjoying the golf. Trying to. Nice. Oh yeah, oh, sweet. John Camera performer. <laughs> I like oh, it. Wow. Okay, moving on. <laughs> Say hi to Kelsey. Uh, Kelsey is uh, the last, but certainly not least, in a um, yeah, I know. Uh, fine See, line of young ladies who is going to oh, golf me today. Um, so, are you excited about the whole wine about golf thing? Uh, I am. Candice kind of told me about it and she pretty much had me at wine. So, I'm, I'm here for the golf too. You know? 
Oh, that's awesome. Yeah. All right, well, give her. At least we get somewhat decent results, right? That's I have a question too. Like, I always This has got to be rigged. Why are there four stunning women who all can golf? I'm so dead. Um, okay, well, I guess it's my turn. Awesome. Thanks, Jeff. Danny, let's see what you got, buddy. Make me proud. This is so not fair. <laughs> Why can't they be like 70? <laughs> They're not in the heart of the uh, golf demographic. That's, no. that's true. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, that's no. not what I taught you. All Sorry. right. Get, when does the wine start? <laughs> right now for you, my friend. DTI, epic fail. Start wine and